Dr. Thomas Lowenheim, Music Director and Conductor of the Fresno State Symphony Orchestra. COVID-19 closed us down last spring. This fall, however, we were able to try something remarkable. We were able to meet in person, though in limited groups and with stringent precautions. This semester we worked on Tchaikovsky's String Serenade and Borodin's Second String Quartet. For this presentation we have selected two movements, one from each work, to share with you. As a response to this difficult time, we have included, between movements, student reflections on the importance of music. I would like to take this opportunity to thank you for joining us and to wish you a happy holiday season. Please wear your masks and keep your distance from each other so we can see you at our live concerts again soon.
I would like to give a big thank you to everyone who was involved in the process of making orchestra live rehearsals. Um, and thank you to Dr. Lohenheim, especially for fighting to keep us with the live rehearsals. Um, this was definitely a highlight in my week. So orchestra for me happened in my living room this year, which was quite interesting. I never thought that would actually happen. Uh, I am one of the students that chose to do orchestra at home and mostly because I am a teacher and I do have to be around children every day and my other um, co-workers and everything too. And I just decided for my own personal safety, it would be the best thing for me to not be around all of these people all the time, even though I really, really missed it. Um, so I think one thing we can say about this semester was we made it and we got through it. Um, a lot of adapting went on and I think a lot of us did that. And I think we, we all kind of grew as people because of it. Um, I also think that the fact that we were able to keep some sort of normalcy as musicians was a huge, um, huge honor to be a part of. I think Dr. Lohenheim did an excellent job making sure protocols and regulations were in place to make sure we were able to meet that once a week. Because I think not only me, but for many others, this one time a week thing was um, something we all look forward to and something we all cherish. I was super grateful to have in-person orchestra rehearsals this semester because playing with an orchestra is my favorite thing about being a musician. And right now we're all isolated at home. So it was really great to be able to play with our friends and create something bigger and better than anything that we could do alone. With the orchestra, we got to um, play together in person, which was an amazing experience. Um, I really enjoy um, playing again with my colleagues since this coronavirus has limited that, that option for us musicians. I think it has been really amazing to be able to at least play in person with all of them. Even wearing a mask um, still brought some, some sense of reality to all of us, which was extremely important for all of us. It is what it is, you know. Um, I made some really great friends along the way this semester, so it was great. I really enjoyed learning about the various violinists and other musicians that I had not known about. And we also really liked the master classes because they're very practical. And we learned a lot from that. Yes, and we also really liked that we got to meet in real life to play with the actual orchestra because it's a lot different than just practicing by yourself or through Zoom. I thought it was really nice to see the um, in-person classes and how dedicated the students were and how they kept coming back after each rehearsal, even though it's really it's a really scary time. And um, it just goes to show that music prevails. I enjoyed every rehearsal, the master classes we had, and playing with my peers. I am grateful for your support and guidance. Thank you. For me, this class was exactly what I needed during this time, and I looked forward to it every week. Thank you, Dr. Lowenheim. And thank you to all the people that made this possible. As well, thank you for caring about our emotional and physical health. Gracias.